Welcome. I would like to demonstrate how to sign, encrypt, and decrypt emails with Apple's mail application using Admin Mac Picard version 1.1. You will need a valid U.S. government CAC or PIV smart card, a smart card reader, Mac OS X Snow Leopard or Lion operating system, and Picard for Mac version 1.1 from Thursby Software. For purposes of this demonstration, we will assume that Picard version 1.1 has already been installed on the Mac and that Apple Mail has properly been configured with your POP or IMAP and SMTP server information to receive and send emails. To send a signed email using Picard, insert your smart card into the smart card reader, open Apple Mail, and click New Message. When the New Message window is displayed, simply click the Sign badge located in the upper right corner of the Message window. In this example, I will send a signed email to Paul Nelson. Type in the subject. Type in the body of my message. And click Send. The signed message will allow the receiver to validate that the email has not been tampered with or altered in any way and you can send signed emails to anyone. However, if you want to send an encrypted email, this is only possible when both the sender and the recipient have email certificates. In this next example, I will send a signed and encrypted email message. Once again, I'll send an, e send an email to Paul. And notice when I type in the subject line, the lock badge is available. I will simply click the lock button, send my message, and click send. Notice that because I had received a signed email from Paul previously, the log badge is available. The easiest way to let Apple Mail know that a recipient has a certificate and to have access to it is for the recipient to first send you a signed email. Apple Mail will automatically store that certificate in the keychain for a future reference. The log badge will not be clickable when the recipient does not have your certificate or if the recipient has your certificate but you do not have the recipients. As I mentioned earlier, your smart card must be inserted into the card reader before opening Apple Mail. This is to allow Mail to decrypt any mail that you have previously opened in your inbox. This is what a signed and encrypted email looks like using Picard with the smart card inserted into the reader. Notice that, that the security shows it is both encrypted and signed. Now if I quit Apple Mail, pull out my smart card, open up Apple Mail again, and click the signed and encrypted email, notice it says it is unable to decrypt the message and the contents of the <coughs> message window is unreadable. The ability to sign and encrypt email using Apple Mail is available in both Picard version 1.1 as well as in Admin Mac PKI for those requiring more advanced functionality like network sign-on, SSO, GPO, and Active Directory. For further information on our products, please visit us at www.thursby.com. Thank you.